Hey guys, how are you? I hope you're having an absolutely wonderful day. I just wanted to make a short video and talk to you for a little bit about uh, something that I want to do to give back to you, uh, my subscribers, my followers, the D&D community at large. Now, I talked about this a lot on the live stream back on Saturday, July 27th, which of course is Gygax Day. You know, we, we like to uh, like to have fun on Gygax Day. That's Gary Gygax's birthday. And, you know, so uh, we'll roll up characters 3D6 down the line or what have you. But it was kind of special this year. So I wanted to talk about something that I'd like to do uh, for somebody out there, somebody that I can kind of help. Uh, and I know not everybody watches the live streams. Uh, you know, it's it's kind of a commitment to sit down and, and watch me ramble for an hour, two hours, three hours, whether I'm by myself or with a guest or or playing D&D. And I, I get it. It's not for everybody. And most people who subscribe to the channel, you're here for the more newsy stuff. And that's OK. That's that's just fine. Um, but if you are just coming by for the first time or you watch my channel before but haven't made that decision yet, uh, please do click the subscribe button and click the bell icon for notifications about future videos because you're definitely going to want the news on what's going on with this. So to spare you guys uh, a big long sob story, um, back from like, uh, I don't know, end of summer 2022 to early 2023, eh, things were a little rocky around Casa Delver. Um, I, I won't go into any details, but it could have been a lot worse than it was, but for some really fantastic people in the community. And I would have to say the high point in, in y'all's support was uh, when one fellow, Hi Bluto, uh, got together with other members of the community and sent me and Mrs. the Dungeon Delver to GaryCon in 2023, all expenses paid. It, it was simply amazing. And the cherry on top of that was uh, because Bluto is also a fan of college football and the Alabama Crimson Tide. Uh, I got to go see Alabama play Arkansas in October of 2023. So, uh, yeah, I, I'd say I was pretty blessed. Um, but even more so, uh, or, or uh, perhaps as much as, um, when I went and uh, I, I visited my friends Todd and Anna, they own the Gods and Monsters uh gaming hobby store, comic book shop uh, here in Orlando. And of course, that's got Vault 5421, the, the Fallout-themed speakeasy attached to it. It's it's just a wonderful place. And uh, no, this is not a paid plug. I, I really, really like uh, Gods and Monsters and, and Todd and Anna are wonderful people. And uh, we've, we exchange... Uh, gifts at holiday time. Well, all I can really do is offer up uh, some homemade cheesecakes. And I don't brag about myself a whole lot, but I make a pretty good cheesecake. You, you can ask me on socials if you ever want a recipe. But um, this, well, last year when I stopped by um, with, uh, with their cheesecake, uh, it had been a really long time since I'd seen them. It had been an exceptionally busy 2022. And um, so I handed over their gift and they said, well, we have something for you. And a customer had brought in uh, for trade an entire library of first edition advanced Dungeons and Dragons products. Um, a Fiend Folio, a Monster Manual to a just a bevy of classic modules. Um, and they said, we want you to have this. And, and, and at first, you know, I said, guys, you know, you, you could bag these up and, and, and sell these for 50, 60, $70 a piece. And, and they, they said, no, no, we, we want you to have this. I mean, I was flabbergasted. Uh, 
And it, it just so happens someone else gave me a Dungeon Master's Guide right around that same time. So I had a nearly complete library of, of core first edition advanced Dungeons and Dragons books. Well, I'm sure you guys have watched my videos and you've seen before, um, I've got enough. <laughs> I've got more than enough. I, I, I've got my, my uh, play copy of the DMG and you know that this is full of autographs including Gary's. Jim Ward's, Errol Otis, Darlene, uh, Dave LaForce. You know, I've got a monster manual. I've got, I, I, I've got all the books up here. Okay, I, I've got everything a boy could ask for. I've got two more copies of the Dungeon Masters Guide. I've got a true first print, and I've got the 2014 reissues. Um. I've got a dozen players' handbooks. I've got, I've got all the great classic D&D modules. And that's not even to get into original D&D and basic D&D that I've got. So I looked at this that they had gifted me, and I thought, well, you know, I suppose I could flip them on eBay or sell them on Facebook. And I thought, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that at all. These were given to me as a gift. And, and it, it really, it highlighted a year when you, the community, whether, you know, you, you follow me on Facebook or on Twitter or you're subscribed here on YouTube or any combination of those, you guys really made what could have been an awful run of months really bright and really wonderful. And I remember talking to Bluto when we met for that football game. And I said, you know, how, how blessed I'd been. And he said, start paying it forward. Start paying it forward. And that is what I'm doing. So here's the thing. I know that there might be somebody out there who really wants to play first edition AD&D. Maybe, maybe you want to play with your kids. Maybe you just want to start playing again. But circumstances are such that there's no way you can afford the extortionate prices that people seem to want to charge on eBay. You know? First edition Dungeon Master's Guide, $999. Buy it now. No low ballers. I know what I got. You know, or even the reprints, the, the, the print on demand from drive through RPG, you know, a whole set of core books without even looking into the modules will still cost you nearly a hundred dollars. Maybe as it gets around the holiday time, that's just not on your menu and it's not going to be on your menu. And so it's for you, whether it's you I'm speaking to or whether someone I'm speaking to knows someone who's in that situation, that's who I want this library of books to go to. Now, I'm going to be including a monster manual in that set. It'll probably be the print-on-demand and at least a few more modules. We've got a, a Keep on the Borderlands, a Secret Bone Hill. We've got uh, the Giants series, the Descent into the Depths series, but not Vault of the Drow, uh, Queen of the Demon Web Pits, and Tomb of Horrors. Well, I'd like to get, you know, the rest of the S modules and, uh, you know, the, maybe Village of Hamlet and the, uh, the, the Slavers modules and include those in there. So I'll get those print on demand. I mean, I'm going to see if it's possible to get a uh, copy of the Unexpurgated Deities and Demigods printed, you know, the ones with Elric and Cthulhu, get that printed up in a nice soft back, you know, it, it won't be some rare treasure that, that, uh, you know, somebody can, can, uh, sell for hundreds of dollars down the line later or something like that, but it'll be the real deal. You know, they'll be able to take it down and say, ah, <laughs> the party wants to fight Azathoth, do they? Well, I've got the stats right here or what have you. Um, I'm also including, now this is not the one, uh, 
but I will be including a copy of the World of Greyhawk folio. I already bought this, and it's with the the uh, the stack of books now over there. So you know, a Greyhawk folio, all the great classic modules, just because I want to, because there's someone out there in need. They don't have the means. Okay, now I've had some folks who maybe misunderstood the the what I said on the live stream or the posts I made uh, on social media. I'm not just giving it away, and certainly, please don't don't ask me to sell it to you. Don't you know? Don't say, "Hey, how about a private sale?" I don't have to tell anyone, you know, that the, that you sold it to me. You can make a little money. That's that's not what this is about. This is about someone out there, whether you're trying to recapture your childhood or give somebody a better childhood and you don't have the means and they don't have the means. Let me know. And no later than the first week of December, I will get these to the person who really, really needs these the most. Um, so... The the uh, only other thing that I would mention about this is it's it's not a contest, you know. Um, it's it's not like I'm going to draw a name out of a hat. I have a lot of consideration to do. Mrs. The Dungeon Delver is going to help me mull over this and and figure out the 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 best uh, person to get this to. Um, now Heidi and Eric over at Gaxland are providing shipping. So the burden for shipping won't be on whoever receives them either. They'll just go to the home of the person who really needs and wants to play first edition AD&D and they don't have the means. You know, uh, I, I wish I had piles of these books, whether they were the, the originals or print on demand or Jeff Easley cover or what have you, just to send out to people who ask. Yeah, I don't, unfortunately. But I do have a set, and there is someone out there who really wants to play AD&D and would really like to have this set. So that's what's coming. Uh, if I didn't mention it, Mage's Musings is throwing in a, uh, a well-loved Oriental Adventures. That'll go in there, too. Um, now, maybe you have someone in a similar situation, and their love is for second edition AD and D. Well, I've got some good news for our two e cousins as well. I have a dungeon master's guide and a player's handbook and a little box full, uh, an unopened box, I might add, full of encounter cards. So it's kind of like a, a card based monster manual. All right. So if two e is your jam instead of first edition AD and D, let me know, and we'll hook you up with those. All right. But. It's just my way of giving back to you guys, the community, because, you know, we've got to have each other's backs because nobody else does, right? You know, I mean, you remember being a nerd in, in high school or middle school? You know, we, we, we've all got to hang together like that. So, again, you know, don't reach out to me and say, uh, here's X amount of dollars. I'll just, I'll take them. Or, uh, hey, can I just have the modules? And then you do, I want it to go as a complete set. And I want to find somebody who's really in need. So with that said, um, stay tuned to this channel for updates uh, for our editions of books adding in. Like I said, there's a monster manual coming and some more modules. And I'll let everybody know about the Deities and Demigods reprint, if I'm going to be able to get that included in there. But uh, anyway, thank you guys for listening to me ramble here for like 10 or 15 minutes. I, I appreciate it all. I appreciate you all. I love you all. Again, if you haven't, even if it's only for the time to keep up with updates, please click the subscribe button and the bell icon for notifications. And I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Be good to each other. Peace.